Hey, welcome back to UFOs Above Us. All right, today we're going to look at a couple of objects near the moon. Um, the first one goes up from the left side, and then the next one goes horizontal across the top of the moon there. All right, so you saw them at real time, and now we'll ratchet the speeds down so you can see them more clearly, and I'll just let you take a couple of looks. All right, now we've got it at a speed where you can see it a little better. That's a classic orb-shaped UFO. This second one, on the other hand, I don't know what this is. Um, you know, there's potential that it could be a satellite. You can notice as it passes the moon, you see it emitting something there. Um, so again, we're looking at the orb-shaped one there. Um, I've videoed these many times. I'm not saying there's anything insignificant about it. It's just I see them regularly. This second one I don't see regularly, so it's really caught my attention. And we're going to focus more on it. Uh, but I will zoom both of these in. If you notice as it passes the moon, you see the trail going out from it? When we blow that up, you'll notice it's actually two objects and two distinct trails being emitted out the back of those. Um, so now I think we're going to do a zoom in size-wise. Oh, one more slow-mo. All right, now I think we zoom in. All right, so here you get a better look at it. Now what I'm seeing here is two bullet-shaped or pointed... Uh, triangular UFOs. Whereas this one, what I see is a circular orb with some kind of a something emitting out the outside edge of it. Now what that is, I don't know, but I see them all the time. I document those regularly. This one I've never seen before, and I've been watching this steadily for two years. Watch as it crosses the moon. Look at that twin exhaust or twin, you know, rocket thrusters or something. Now, I don't know what this object is. We'll look at it one more time, and then I've got a couple of stills to see it closer. It could be a satellite. could be a meteorite. Um, I just It doesn't look like either of those. It looks like some kind of an intelligent design. And the reason I say that, wait till you see the stills. The still images that I captured of it as we blow those up, it definitely looks pointed. It looks wedge-shaped or triangular-shaped. This one you see even a little better. And you can see two distinct trails coming out the back of it. So what this is, I don't know, uh, but I thought I'd share it. So for UFOs above us, keep watching the skies.